The final round of the 2011 Hyundai Tournament of Champions who would win the season opening event from the Plantation Course at Kapalua. Started the day with a three-way tie, but Graham McDowell charging and the man from Northern Ireland stealing the show in 2010. He's off and running here in 11. Here he is at 18. And McDowell, a bogey-free round, a total of 11 birdies. He would have a chance at one more at the last, but he would miss that for a 61. He matches the course record with a 62. How would he factor at the end of the day? Jonathan Bird beginning his round with a share of the lead. And look at this fortuitous bounce at number one. This is a difficult hole to start your round. Over 500 yards, yet Jonathan Bird one of the few that made birdie there. That may factor for later in the day as well. Birdie chance at 10 now. Jonathan Bird making the turn in three under, make it four under on the round. He would add another at 13, and now with a share of the lead at 15, just a flip of the wedge here at the par five. Sixth birdie on the round for Bird, and he was charging to the top of the leaderboard. Robert Garrigus, with a chance as well. Come on. And Garrigus asking for it to reach the green. Are you ready? From 283 yards, Garrigus sends this to the back of the putting surface. And from just outside of 10 feet, he would have a chance to make an eagle putt for the win. Garrigus all charged up. Does he have the line? Just misses on the left side. Hard to accept, but he taps in for birdie. Jonathan Bird has a birdie chance at 18 to end it. And he comes up just short. So Bird, Garrigus, off to extra holes. They settle for par at the first of the sudden death. That was at 18. This is back at number one, where Bird made birdie earlier in the day. Nearly has another. He taps in for par and now forces Robert Garrigus from three and a half feet to extend the playoff. And Garrigus pushes it through the break. Tough way to lose, but Jonathan Bird in back-to-back -back starts on the PGA Tour. He has a win, his fifth in his career. Be sure and tune in Thursday. First round action, seven o'clock on Golf Channel for the Sony Open in Hawaii.